standing in front of the new front of our spaceship. What you're looking at is a big curved, what will appear to be bubble. Uh, what you've seen us do in the past has added this curved front to the spaceship that goes up to like counter height. What you're looking at now will actually set on top of that counter and go up and back. We talked about doing this in other videos and you've seen in prior videos these arcs, these five curved arcs that go up and define this shape. We decided that it was going to be a whole lot easier to do this work inside. So Corey built this big elaborate cribbing that tied those five arcs together and locked them into the alignment that we need them uh, to be on the final installation. This building, you know, it started life as a manufactured home and those aren't the most robust structures. They're also not that square. So it made a lot of sense to install the arcs first, lock them in place, and then bring them inside. So from there, we've been planking this kind of like a boat. And by that, I mean, we've started with these planks. They're, they're kind of straight planks, every other. And then we take another piece of plywood that the planks are made of and fold it over the gap left between every other plank and then scribe the back side of it to get the shape right, cut it with a bandsaw, kind of tune it into place with a hand plane and then reinstall it. That's how we have done the bulk of this, this thing that you see behind me. From there, we've also done these transitions on the sides using narrower planks to kind of meet from the, the big curve to what is the, the square side of the ship. Once this is all planked and sanded and fared out, we'll fiberglass it and then cut these big window shapes out of, out of the front. It's going to look really cool. So in the rest of this week's video, you get to see us get this far, uh, the cribbing, the arcs, doing the initial planking and all that. Uh, soon we'll have a part two where we'll fiberglass it, cut out the windows and do the rest. It's all looking awesome. I cannot wait to show you what this is going to look when it's back on the front of the ship. I can't wait to see it back in the front of the ship. We are really happy with how this is turning out and how this will make this building as it travels down the road look so much more than it does today. Lots of other work has been going on in the background. We'll show you a little bit more of that as things continue. Uh, thanks for watching and I hope you enjoy. We're about to lift this entire curved structure off the ship and uh, move it into the shop so we can skin and fiberglass the exterior inside instead of, you know, up here. Assuming it actually works.
How many times a day do you say that, Corey? Uh, at least 20. Yeah. So this is the side kind of profile of this big structure that goes in the front of the spaceship. And then working on skinning this lower area is kind of to figure out the process. This is about half the width of the structure. So I've got it all skinned and fared, kind of fared out, smoothed out. And I wish I could like just show through the video somehow how smooth this is and how cool it feels. <laughs> I'm really, really happy with it.